What's up? Good afternoon, good morning, good night. Whenever you're listening to this Fantasy House listeners, my beloved listeners, you guys are the freaking best. Seriously, you guys, you guys give me artistic purpose. You guys make me keep keep on rocking and rolling in the free world. Uh, right now, I am giving you a bonus episode. I was on the hilarious comedy podcast, Guys Night Out. With two of my good friends, Road Dogs and good friends, Chris Lev and Michael Linochi. These guys are awesome. I, They're just, they're solid dudes. They're both hilarious. They, they've, they're they both very giving, cool people that have always been super, super rad. And we did a swap cast. So I got to be on Guys Night Out and they were on Fantasy House and we released on each other's feed. So I'm releasing this episode of Guys Night Out on the Fantasy House feed for you guys. And they're releasing Fantasy House on their feed for their listeners. So it's really really cool i'm very stoked if you guys like this episode go ahead go subscribe to their podcast leave them a review also if you haven't left me a review leave me a review uh i'm pushing for 50 reviews by july 4th i'm at 30 or 31 right now thank you to all of you who have given me reviews i'm gonna read them out loud soon it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun 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 we like having fun here because being silly and having fun is one of the finest things about uh, living in a free country and being alive. So check out Guys Night Out podcast that's about to play right now. Enjoy, and I hope you have a great, great day. All right, ah, here it is. This is the Guys Night Out podcast with Michael Linochi and Chris Lev. Gosh, night out. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> like, I'm like, guys, oh, really? I like, vote a lot really? of awards. I actually for... thought it was really good. <laughs> it is good, dude. And he made it. I made it. Dude. He made the thing. So uh, I, make... I work a lot with uh producers. So like I I'm in the I'm in the beats game. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, this is interesting because I can't see Chris. So yeah, back up. Oh, you want, back you want me to scoot up? up? Back up. Yeah, because this is weird, huh? That's yeah, a weird s- thing that was going on. I was like, wait, what's yeah. going on? What are we at? <laughs> I looked over and I was like, wait, restaurant? <laughs> They sat. They sat us uh, wrong. Nice, right? dude. I thought that was a New York Jets hat, and I was about to say you have to leave. Oh, dude. I'm sorry, Mike. I don't even play the sports game. I would accidentally wear it probably and be like, huh? I just grabbed it from a box that I saw somewhere. It looks like you f- you were you, def- you did a lot of fishing this week. <laughs> yeah, you just this got is for a fishing boat. company, dude. I wish I did a lot of fishing this week. Have you ever yeah. gone fishing? You yeah. look like you yeah, good at fishing. fishing cause you Mike, have, have you ever gone fishing? Have you ever gone fishing? Yeah. When I was Were you good at it? No, I, I can't. I don't have the patience for that. Um, hey, everybody! Welcome to Guys on Out Podcast. My name is Chris Lev. Sitting next to me is local bank teller Michael Linochi, and also our special guest today, John Shevsky. Shevsky, what's Hi. up? I'm Mike. Nice to meet Hi, you. Great to meet you, yeah, Mike you and Frank. Frank. Yeah. <laughs> it rhymes with Chris, right? It does. That's why um, I can remember it. Um, that's cool. What's dude. up, man? Hey, uh, uh, John is a comedian friend of ours. Very funny. Has his own podcast. Check it out called Fantasy House. Please, it's all, to please check it please out check on it iTunes out and subscribe. Uh, subscribe, we'll rate, review. Immediate. We'll get into that. We'll get into yeah, that. Yeah, we will we'll have to <laughs> immediately plug him. Let's get to know him and see if you like him. Retract first. my plugs. Yeah, <laughs> like, take him back. That. Don't take think him about back. that. You don't want immediate plugs? Well, I mean, I'm getting him out of the I way think, early. I feel baby. like it's ba- like I don't know what. First of all, wait. Are you so you do stand up? I. <laughs> so insulting. Wait, he's immediately, no, no, he's no, no, immediately no, this is a good, going into this is a good, this is a good go place to start it. off because Mike I, and Mike yeah. and I have been, we've we've done you many gigs together. The, first of all, yeah. these are listeners, so they don't know who you are. So like, it's, it's, uh, I'm <laughs> I sorry, said comedian. We didn't, have, we didn't have Ellen come on, so like, yes, that's a comedian. Get into that. I didn't mean it to be rude. I kind of did because it's funny <laughs> no. too. But a uh, uh, joke aside, yes, I think you're funny. That's why you're here. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here. But now, hey, so tell everyone who you are. I I think I've done stand up. I think I'm gonna start doing stand up. Start doing it. I, I, I appreciate you guys both fighting over how to treat me good cop, bad cop. Yeah, I, I love that. Fine. Just, just right off the bat, I was like, I can't wait for these guys just to <laughs> be, beat me up, then rub oil on me, then beat me up again. Oh, yeah. and just yeah, like, that's, that's ice it. And then like, oh, yeah, dude. Uh, so, yeah, but uh, stand-up comedy. I love stand-up comedy. Yeah. Uh, I haven't done it in like fucking five months. But, uh, <laughs> Woo, yeah, dude, I haven't done it. But in that's how we, I, we know you through stand-up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, Obviously, it's, I don't see you as much as I'd like. 
but that's fine. That's very sweet. I but it, you know what? It, doesn't it make you like more excited when you do get to hang out? Like I was like, I'll I was tell looking you what, forward to there's, it. Was, there's it's true. literally in comedy. All right, I've been doing it almost nine years. There's certain people that make you funnier, and I feel like I've only met maybe six of those people in my life, and you're one of them. I swear, yeah, I thought he was going to do a left turn on it. It's like, yeah, and me. you and I both know the si- the same person, <laughs> and they make us feel like that, right? No, they, uh, they're, they're just, I'm not saying I don't like being around other comics. I'm no, saying I'm, there's I'm certain riffing. guys that like, oh wow, they really like inspire my riffing or whatever. Like it's you and Dino Archie or two. He's another guy who I'm like, whenever I'm with him, I feel like he gets me going. I don't I'm know a why. regular John, call me, uh, classic riffer. Yeah. Also known as the Pale Dino Archie. So yes. <laughs> yes. That's Very. true. Uh, that's well, I true. feel I, I feel the same. I, I I've told you before. Like you you tell uh, material. You have jokes about things that are so hard to. And I don't th- I don't know if this is like a douchey thing for me to say or not. I, I, it's just how I feel. We're d- you, I'm the douche. You have material. You, you have material. Do this. Yeah. Is that bad to do that? No, but he when he like, does it, it just seems it just seems like he just got done fucking the chick. I just got yeah, told un- when she was unwilling though. No, like it just no, seems like he, like no he comes way. out he comes out of his frat room no, no and he's just way. like fuck no, yeah. Dude, yeah. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm fuck fall, yeah, dude. I'm, she might have said yes. Yeah, so when he comes you, out and he I'm, says that. I'm good he comes looking. out and he goes fucking I'm good looking. Fuck yeah. I'm a good looking guy. Yeah. That's, that's fine. So what I'm saying is they want you to sleep. No, no, no. You still might do it. You still might do it. What I'm saying is goofy good looking guy so most girls you come in and you go want it. Genetic consent. Want it? Yeah, they want it. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> so oh, yeah. hold on before the before the frat thing he was she about was to compl- kind of asleep he was about to compliment me let's hear it let's get back to that compliment <laughs> fuck yeah <laughs> Rewind. Off way better i was just gonna say that you uh, this is it just turned into let's open the show with john shevsky kissing our host's asses uh, <laughs> nice. uh, that's what he wanted that's it a to good be. voice uh, but i i remember uh when it clicked because i i we've always just had fun together and if i like someone i don't even like sometimes i won't even see someone on stage i'll road dog with you and be like oh shit i was taking a shit while you were on stage but you're still my you're still my homie. Yeah, yeah. But we were we were hanging out doing a spot, and I'd seen you kill a bunch, and I just I respected you for just being able to kill because that's a it's a craft to be able to just go anywhere and just have a great set. And you were humble about killing. And I was uh, humble. You were. You were. Fuck I, like, yeah. In fu- it, maybe in funny way. But I like, knew you, I was making totally, a change. Totally. Uh, this was years ago. Maybe you didn't know me well enough at the time <laughs> to where you could be like a cocky prick about it. You were like just just cool about it. Yeah. And 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 I was like, dude, fucking great set. But then after a few times of us doing some gigs together and seeing you and being like, man, you're joking about the exact stuff that I I'm, I'm a pretentious nerd where I'm just like boring like sitting in the obvi- audience of comedy or like boring yeah, yeah, yeah. and and you joke about stuff that like so many comedians talk about that I'm like. I could give a shit, but you make it hilarious. I'm always like, dude, this guy that you can talk about dating, which is yeah. fucking boring to me. It's yeah, just like, sure. I, like, I want to hear like, it's even boring to me. I don't even do it as yeah, much anymore. But but even when you just talk about like meeting people and shit, like your observational way of communicating that could be very Seinfeldian where you're like, all right, cool. Like I've heard it, but like, tell me something I don't know. And you are able to get in there and like, yeah, just make it hilarious. Oh, thank and you. Your dry shit. <laughs> Your deadpan stuff too is hilarious. Thank you. Uh, I love hey. describing my comic friends to my non-comic friends. Like, yeah. oh, I'm going to go hang out with so and so, and his humor is kind of. I was like, talking <laughs> about a restaurant. I can, first of all, I, ne- I, I can never do that. What describe it's too it? Tough. Just even else? having a conversation with someone, I hate. I'm I just know. like, how do I get out of this? It's, this but I'm a, a nerdy slog. asshole that does that kind of shit to people. I'm probably no, the worst I need pers- to tell you about this <laughs> comic. I know you have to understand I what I understand. <laughs> yeah. Um. Th- yeah. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. I think you still look like you fish a lot. I wish I fished more, like as much as I look like I fish. I fish like once every. Either five that years. or you look, yeah, <laughs> I, you're, you're, like for sure, Forrest Gump would wear your outfit. I don't have a problem with that. Forrest Gump didn't get Forrest yeah, Gump didn't get these Converse before they went out of out of stock. Yeah, he could have. Now c- a compliment, Chris. Now that's our podcast. We. You I don't have anything left. I splooshed oh, my compliment. God I need, damn it! I, need to, I knew it. I need to smoke something and I I eat a sandwich, and then we it's can okay. start making it's out again. What about his? What about his tennis court shirt? I love this shirt. It's, it's like he's part of a tennis club. Part of a tennis club? I look like I just got off a boat in Italy, like yeah. rowing oh, one of those yeah. boats. I just, I just that, a that Russian sailor or like a, a guy. Russian sailor. That's I like true, Russian yeah. sailor. I'm just, I just, Something I'm with on the a, water. I'm, I'm on the back of oh, a yeah. gondola and I go, oh, <laughs> I don't even know <laughs> what a gondola go is. Down the fucking a new word. We're through the canals in Venice. travel on. So I, they either I go up. I assume that's what it was. but like I a boat. I had no clue what that was called. Well, you learn something you new learn every something day. That's what this podcast is all about. And Chris is like a Louis C.K. that hasn't jerked off in front of people. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That's my that's the way I describe you guys. 
<laughs> yet. <laughs> yeah. Well, you've, well, I've I mean, I mean, I should, I should, yeah, that should be way more specific. Describe I think people. I think we've all <laughs> masturbated in front of people, but there's just different people that get in trouble for it or not. Am I right, folks? Is this hey, a clean uh, podcast? Yeah. No. no I've listened to a little bit of guys no, that I understand. Not. Were you like, get me the fuck out of here? <laughs> huh? Were you like, I'm done with this? This is right over. Away? I'm over. What do you mean when I when listen? you listen to our episode? No, I, I have a good time. I don't listen to a lot of comedy of podcasts course, though, me. so I listen to it to like check out my friend's shit and be like, know what's going on. But wow, you're like. You're a weird, nice I'm a weirdo. guy. Yeah, yeah. I don't think a lot of comedians <laughs> do that. Dude, he just comes out and he's like, I mean, I listen to you Rogan. You know what? You're a, w- yeah, but that's a real different. weirdo. I'll listen to Rogan. But that's I'll listen different. to like Neil deGrasse Tyson talk about a few things. I'll yeah, listen yeah, yeah. to like people talk about like psychology and like weird, like, you know, robot stuff. And I'll be like, whoa, like that. Well, what? Okay. How did you get your idea for your podcast? Uh, I. I think yeah. So tell it, us about your podcast. I think over the years, just uh, of life, just like at times when I get re- inebriated, life is the reason you. Get, you're I like, get inebriated. Life. I just get inebriated somewhere, and I'll be like, "Oh, that would be so much fun to do!" Like when I get an idea, like when yeah. you know those vision board ideas, like I want to do that. I just write it down, and then when I need to, an idea for something, I go to that paper because I'm lazy, <laughs> and I'm like, "I'm not gonna think of a you new one." Whole Let me see what I already figured. Ideas? Dude, I have like I have like an insane person's like on my computer, like different <laughs> files, different formats. Like, like I used to write dots. it into Word, then I would draw it into Photoshop. Like I just have it written all over. <laughs> books yeah it's, it's insane <laughs> but I, j- I just wrote it down one day and then we needed content for when i was doing crime we needed content for the patreon because people pay for yep. patreon and yeah. you're like you promised them like hey if you support us we're gonna give you extra stuff so yeah, i was like we, i gotta do like another podcast we we give them um, hey speaking of go to uh, patreon.com back go, guys night out go to guys that at patreon and you know what <laughs> this shirt right you get a here fucking dope shirt. for you so you get oh, a shirt for the guest I was just saying how I love the, the, the actual you like get the, the, that. That's you get what the shirt. you get. You get yeah, the shirt. shirt. I can't wait to wear this. Fishing. Flip that around. Flip that around. So you yeah. get you get the guys night out uh, Greek letters <laughs> on the back, and then if we have women's sizes, you get a lady bug on the back yeah. of that instead of the Greek oh, letters. Oh, you do. Oh, yeah. that's, that's and I think man the man next shirts will just be black with that. It will yeah. pop more probably. It'll, it'll be, yeah, it'll look better. Dude. And maybe well, these well, are still dope. These can are I great. come back I'll on the podcast and get the good shirt? <laughs> yeah, oh, probably. Fucking. But I mean, that's not gonna be for a while. No, it, we're please. gonna have a lot of dope shirts. You have that, to pace it out. Is that how you're gonna hold the shirt up for the whole show around your neck? Because we're trying to <laughs> like, advertise it. So maybe if you could lay it like out, you just in got front of you. back from a run. Like a Forrest yeah. Gump just got back from a run. Maybe laid like he out just, in front of you <laughs> on the table. Like when Forrest was like leaving Alabama, yeah, it looks knees. like you only got to like Texas, yeah, and you this. were like, "Let me just I'll put this it, around laid my neck. Out on your knees." <laughs> Yeah, yeah, maybe there. That's better. Yeah, there perfect. we go. There we go. So, and that's what you're gonna do for the whole I'll advertisement. I'm gonna make myself useful. Earn my keep. There we there go. go. I'm a merch baby. dude. Yeah. So tell us about your podcast, Fantasy House. Uh, Fantasy House. It's basically imaginary MTV cribs in like the Rick and Morty universe. Like it's just. I tell people I, I send well you guys know because I, I, I had you guys on I send yeah. you like a little outline that's that's like mm-hmm. hey come up with like the trippiest kitchen make it all unique to your personality so much fucking fun and then we, you just guide us through a, a, a tour a virtual tour of it and we just sit there and imagine you, you gave this us. a lot of airtime by the way dude it's yeah. fun uh, oh so much fun both Michael and I did an episode of Fantasy House separate one so this week you're actually going to get bonus episodes bonus. you're going to hear our episodes of Fantasy yeah. House on this feed oh yeah and then we're going to cross post uh, this episode also to uh, the fantasy, John's yeah, fantasy, the fantasy house. house. I feed. also don't remember doing his podcast. Were Is you, that a good what sign? Were you, were you on meth? No, I just I don't remember. What? He said I did. I don't remember doing it. You you were just we were, no. You just, we I don't blacked understand. out and then just came I back blacked in. Out. And really yeah, I blacked out. I remember driving uh-huh. to North Hollywood. Yeah, uh-huh. and then I remember waking up the next morning. Really? That was it. What that's the it? fuck yeah. happened? Was your butthole all right? I, I no, yeah, my butt. Yeah, because yeah, that's the first thing I thought. I was like, maybe you woke I up and that was the first. Thing you I was like, maybe I was drugged <gasps> and it your jaw. Was your jaw sore? Yeah, how was your jaw? I but thought that was maybe from the fall. <laughs> Were you the fall? fall from the fall. The fall. They what do fall? call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You remember get, just getting weird. tossed out. I'm of your a in season. So <laughs> I'm actually curious to hear what I talked about because I'm like, wow, I don't remember. Dude, it's it's been a while. I don't remember because we were yeah. at like 22 episodes now. I was 28 when we did it. 28 years old. 28 years old. So it's like wow, seven was years like ago. Seven years. That's a yeah. long time. I don't Dude. remember. So many. I, uh, John's podcast comes out once a year by yeah. that timeline. Yeah. <laughs> well, I figure you know, like give people time to want yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You gotta let intens- anticipation <laughs> you build. build up and kind of. And know. it's all random. It, I agree. You, you put out an episode on December 16th and January yeah. 2nd. It <laughs> but was, yeah. And then nothing in between. But no, no, yeah. a lot of content every Thursday. I put out. Hey, you want another episode? It's coming, yeah, and that's it. You download it. <laughs> that was crazy. It's worth it. Might it be an yeah. episode? It might not. Um, yeah, it was so much fun. We had a lot of fun on our on my episode. Uh, I had a room dedicated Dude. to farting. <laughs> it looked like you guys just in your picture had more fun than we had. 
Well, and that kind of bothered me. In we all definitely fairness, have fun. So, in all fairness, that's all my fault because, yeah. uh, like, the the newer the podcast is for me, the more I'm like uptight, like trying to make sure it goes on time, hoping you're having a, it's like a guest. Uh, what yeah. do you call it when you're hosting a party? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, but I he went after having fun. Okay, is this and, right? Huh? Yeah, he went after. Yeah, he went after you. So, like, by the time I did his, I was like a lot more comfortable. Like, yeah, I know how everything's gonna be. Like, just have fun. Tell me this, and I know, like, you know, the instincts kick in on how to do your podcast. Just like you guys. Yeah, and it's like, and also, in all fairness, like I'm way better than you. Do you think that he was better? Tell me now, dude. Uh, and you can be honest about it. Be totally honest. Then I'll fucking redo my episode. Be totally honest. I'll redo my episode. 100% honest. Who had a better episode? I'll redo it, dude. On I'll a scale, fucking redo it. On a it. scale from 1 to 10. Ta- tell me I have to redo it. On a scale will. from 1 to 10. <laughs> I was a little Great unprepared. Mike's episode. Boy. It's, it's, it's not going to offend me. In my fantasy house, I want a room where I don't have to have an opinion on anything. It's a lot of pressure. <laughs> nice. I'm stressed out, man. Is that near the kitchen? That's, or is that is one. that off the main hallway? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fantasy house reference. Bow, 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 uh, bow. Oh, so you liked it so, better with him. So, oh, no, baby. You can tell you just look at some finger pain. Baby, please. <laughs> <laughs> you don't understand. Oh, oh, I got him. I was what like, was it? What did he have that I didn't she have? Broke oh. me. I had a fucking backyard and stuff. Oh, did you do a regular house? <laughs> no, I had weird what stuff. If yours, what if my Dude, what if fantasy Mike was house like, roast battles? Like, your fantasy <laughs> house fucking sucks. Well, I'll be honest. Yo, dude. your den's only fit for one desk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> dude, I'll be honest. Oh, With dude. fantasy stuff, I have a hard time of actually, like, be, like in, in, in NBA 2K, you create your own player. Did you I'm say fu- NBA 2K? 2K. <laughs> oh, I was like, I didn't even know. I'm That's fi- pretty creative. Bro, even in that <laughs> fantasy world, Pride Month. I'm 5'11". I don't even make myself 6'6". Six, six, yeah, that's the best like part. That's the best part. Dude, in Madden, I, was always, yeah. I would always make myself like 5'9". Five, five, like yeah, five, five, that's first world no, problems no, no, no. right five, there. Nine, five, five, nine. I'm 5'9". Five, five, I'm 5'9". Five, He's 5'10", five, 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 depending on what shoes I wear. You know this is a fact. I'm 5'11 with cleats. Yeah, uh, you're not 5'11 with cleats. You're not 5'11 no, with cleats. I'm 6 cleats. feet with cleats. You're, you're, no, you're yes, not. Get the fuck out of here. I'm 5'10 and a half. You're 5'10 and a half? You're 5'11 at best with a pair of Timberlands on. We can settle this right now. Barefoot, I'm 5'10 and a half. Nope. Well, yeah. Um. We could settle this right now. About who had the better episode? I had a combat pit in my fantasy house. <laughs> I had dinosaurs, didn't I? Dude, I, you, didn't I have, your like, episode mini was dinosaurs? hilarious. You had some weird... You had, your pool was a trip. Oh, yeah. Fuck your yeah. Pool, what did you do in your pool? I your forgot. pool... Okay, you forgot, but let me remind you, because this this is popping back Bro, at me. you got to understand, I was, was riffing this whole episode. So there's, like, standard things when you tell people, uh, and I, by all, all fairness, I've only been, like... Almost all comedians. I've had a few realtors and a couple other like. Oh yeah, hey, people. let me get a realtor to tell yeah. me a fantasy. Dude, it's house. fun. Oh yeah, my, yeah, my yeah that makes sense. Had, actually, my Austin had a great that fantasy. Actually, makes yeah, sense. we see tons of houses all the time. I don't so know why so I said it like that. Wouldn't make but, sense. But you had a pool. I don't know if you you might remember now. You had a pool that was in the water had ecstasy in it. And you had fish in there that were like super lovey dovey. So you go, people would go into the pool, <laughs> oh, yeah, and the fish would be you. like all like kissing you and like yeah, as like you swam around. Weird, that's dope. That's pretty unique, dope. <laughs> unique interactions with animals, kind of stuff. And I remember just sitting there, be like, what the? <laughs> Like it I was, like that. and that that that's the whole reason I do the podcast is to be like, oh damn, yo! Like, I remember oh. that would be dope if you went into your pool and like all the fish that were in there <laughs> yeah, like kissed, kissed you as you yeah. were swimming. You're just like this. It's just like, a, it's peaceful. It's a funny, yeah. It's, like at that. first, it's weird too. Like, why do I want kiss, kisses from fish? But then it's like, well, like when your cat gives you a kiss or your dog licks you, you're happy, right? So why not have a bunch of fish yeah, kissing you? Different type of fish. <laughs> yeah, nothing wrong with that. It's you true. look like that's the kind true. of guy that would want uh, fish kisses with you. Oh, the there's just, just like a, just cu- a drunk guy. There's yeah, a couple in front of you. <laughs> Literally. This is, guy, this is the guy that's passing out of my gondola. I'm, yeah. I'm doing it, and Shesky's on the back of me. Because like, he's divorced. Uh, uh, he's like, this is where we went on our honeymoon. <laughs> my wife took gonna, half the fantasy house. I was going to take my wife here, but she left with her boyfriend, Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> well, and I'm back there going, all over the world. <laughs> she loved Cabernet. She's throwing up. Um. Yeah, so we have a couple of topics we want to cover this week. Uh, oh, Mike, speaking wait. of video game, wait, 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 what, 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 wait, wait, what, 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 what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have a couple of topics. So we, I mean, we always have topics. Oh, I thought we're that this was just like a special ad episode we were doing to promote, and then then we were done. <laughs> what? Oh you, I my hope you're joking god, right you now. are so fucking. What? I, I hope you're joking right now. Really? No. What do you mean? I thought we were. That's what he told me. Oh no, I never he said told me that. that. We're just gonna have. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. Don't try to tur- don't try to turn this on me. Let me start with a hashtag blessed guest. Either way, I'm happy. <laughs> so walk in the door with that disclosure hey, right there. We're disclaimer. just going to do a 15 minute episode and get to know you. And then if we still like you, we'll keep going. But obviously we're cutting okay. it short. I, That's didn't say, I didn't say that. No. I never said that. Life is a job interview. Carry on, Nazis. <laughs> Go on. Drill me. So I'll try a, to make no, the team. On. You're a dad. That's a uh, parent. <laughs> no, oh, whoa. You're a parent. That's, uh, that's pretty funny. That's <laughs> yeah, that was. That's a you're, parent, a pa- yeah. you're a dad. I'm a dad. Yeah, I'm on. Bro, what's that like? Yeah, we're not dads. 
What's that like? You guys are dads. Your kids are just so young they're still in your balls. Get it? Wow. That's a dad joke. You notice and how that's something a dad happens? Joke. You know what happened? I don't like how dad joke rhymes with bad joke. It just kind of <laughs> it gets me it right here, dog. On the inside. No, yeah. uh, um, well, I mean, how about this? It's great. What is it like being in a world of comedy, but then you have kids? Ooh. Oh, that's great. Freaking, this is going to get deep and serious, and then you guys can just roast me and make it not serious. No, no, it's fine. Uh, do you do you, I oh, do you wish they weren't around? No, not. Oh, oh okay. no, dude, they made my that they made it everything everything uh, fell into place like. Because priorities, like, you know, before before having kids, I was constantly like, hey, what's God? I know that you don't seem to interact with people nowadays, which is pretty fucked up. But if you could just like give me some purpose here because I'm trying to figure it out. I could never understand like what purpose was like. Feel it truly. Like people yeah. could tell you, you know, from all all around the, your life. But I was like, always just like, yeah, but like anything could be. And then as soon as I had my first son, I was just like, oh, I got it. Like without even having to think about it. You're just what like, do you mean? I got it. Like I just understood like everything, all the joy and uh, like priorities, like stuff that I was like super important to me forever was like. Oh, I want to like master this craft and I want to like do this thing and be, be, you know, like really happy about this achievements, you know what I mean? And just enjoy my job basically. Like I want to uh-huh. be a stand up comedian and just enjoy my job. Like that was my whole thing. And then like once it, the baby's born uh, for me, I was just like, Oh, like I want my baby to be happy. I want my, uh, I didn't need other things to make me happy either, which was kind of interesting. Like before the kid, like there was a lot of stuff like stand up kind of stuff or like the addictions in life where you're like, oh, I, want, I just want to feel that rush and feel that excitement. And then then after the baby, just just joy where I was just like, oh, like, I still I'm stressed out. I mean, I'm still like trying to work and be like, oh, I need sleep. And like, yeah. my, my wife's tired and I don't know what to tell her because I can't do anything the else. Like, the baby. Oh, yeah. All my hypochondria stuff that I was like, I finally got over that, guys. I'm all good. <laughs> I'm an alpha male now. Everything's cool. Let's go fishing, as you guys would probably yeah. assume. Yeah, I've, sure, I've, for I've, sure. I've, yeah. I rarely fish. But like, let's go do something. And like, yeah, it's all good. Everything's covered. And then you have your kid and you're like, is, is he all right? Is, is everything fine? Like, he that's what I would think he gets that a you fever. would be worried about oh, it all dude, the time. It's it. nuts. It. You would be worried it, about it, it all it, the time. It, it, the, it the movie? It the, the movie. Kids. Is, the, oh. is the next one going to come out soon? Oh, yeah. I'm scared of that movie. What was it like... <laughs> Conceiving, dude, so <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, 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 okay, go do on. You still, wait, do, once you have kids, do you, do you still have sex with my wife? Well, yeah. yeah. Well, I hopefully. Oh, I mean, yeah. I wouldn't fucking you call you out. Exactly I have little. three girlfriends now, dog. I have tons of sex. <laughs> no, um, I, I, yeah, I still have sex. You, yeah, you do. Yeah. Okay. I still, I still so you sex. hear you hear it slows down. That's a Tight. rumor. Well, it, it definitely slows down, but then like, uh, is it still passionate, or is it just oh, hey, yeah. we're trying to get each other off? Should I get my wife on here too, so we could she, <laughs> so she could be like, it's still pretty passionate. <laughs> like, no, it's it's still. It's he doesn't still, kiss me as deeply as I like anymore. No, he never looks in the eyes. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, he's, we're always all, staring at it's a wall. reverse cowgirl and wigs from here on yeah. out. No, uh, no, it's it's uh, yeah. No, I, you I, don't I, have to do this I, anymore. No, I feel like I should, dude. I don't want to let, let you guys down with <laughs> the t-shirt salesman. It. Listen, I, I I signed on. I said I'm a merch guy. I'll yeah, handle yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I, I still I still get get laid. It's nice. I, I nice. Think I'd like it to be twi- fuck yeah. Twice, still, a, twice still, a week instead you, of once. You Sorry for saying it. that out loud, babe. She uh, she won't she won't see she's it. She's not gonna do it. She won't see it. Um, she's probably gonna see it. I'll make, oh, really? I'll, I'll make her watch this. She'll <laughs> she'll highlight laugh. this she'll this laugh. on YouTube. She'll laugh. She'll like, my part. husband said he had to work tonight. <laughs> 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 grown men doing podcasts yeah, 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 yeah. And like yeah yeah kids I'll be home later daddy's got I gotta, a, I gotta think I gotta think I gotta, I gotta, gotta do work daddy's gotta riff and <laughs> record if you know what I mean babies <laughs> thousand people are gonna hear well this is evidence <laughs> that you were um, they want me to be happy too you know uh, my kids want me to be happy what was it like whenever she told you that she was pregnant because I every time I haven't matched to- like I, I never get the tone right whenever my girlfriend tells me she got her period oh yeah because I'm always like yes and she's like no, it hurts. I'm like, oh, are you? Are you yeah, but like, okay? but yeah, for other stuff. Like, well, you know, you're not gonna get her pregnant, like, right? She's on birth control. Fucking bah! or something. We, we high five. I go, Wah! and she goes, no, no, I'm not ready for high fives. You're that, but you're not worried <laughs> that you could get her pregnant. I fucking set off streamers. I go, pew, did you, pew, did you, did you, pew. <laughs> she's like, I need, I need, most, <laughs> I need. She's like, I need. Uh, Advil. Oh, I thought you meant sexually, like how you bust, like you set off streamers, and you're. Oh, like, that's what oh, I do too. No, 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 no. We've already, we've already talked about this. Okay. Uh, I look, I look them dead in the eye, and I go, oh, I love chunky marinara sauce. <laughs> you gonna say weird? I, go, I, go, I lean in real close to my girl, and I go. I go uh, the Steelers gonna go eight and eight this year, and I fuck I go, as you, as you go. Oh, and wow. then I pop out and I go. I think ten and six <laughs> <laughs> from behind the pill, pillow. Wait, or so, or just so and your kids were planned, right? Uh, first one was totally planned. Oh, and, here we go. So, so for reference, when she turned sixteen. 
Oh, dude. You were a mistake. It, well, they're, they're he's, first of all. Oh, uh, well, see, God I, willing, I they'll be he's when they're 16, too. <laughs> With modern technology and society, they're like, I don't know what I am. I'm an alien. I'm a dolphin. I watch too much South Park. <laughs> oh, man. Um, no, but the, the, yeah, dude, the first one was uh, we both decided. I should also know it's both boys because I definitely liked a, a, a recent photo. It's okay of if you forget, though, like your friend's yeah, kids. Yeah, I don't genders. even remember the episode. My, my, did, yeah. my one son's only six Seven months old. Ago. He could be a girl. You don't even, you know. Yeah. And uh, you found him at the, the fire mall. department. The, the son? The f- <laughs> yeah. You found him there. A stork dropped him <laughs> off after I came inside your first, mother. First one was playing. Second yeah. one just picked him up in the mall. Yeah, <laughs> yeah dude. Uh, yeah, so the first one was super planned. And Do it they was, like each other? Oh, yeah. They're, they're, they're great. You, well, they, you, well, how, how, what's the oldest? Uh, oldest is three. He'll be three next week. So he's already speaking two languages. Oh, it's gnarly. <laughs> wow. It's Spanish gnarly. and Italian. Yeah. Hasn't even started English. Yeah. He does yet. speak a little Spanish. It's, it's incredible. He's like, it's, Ma, yeah. yeah, because if you say K, that's right. K. He, he knows agua. Agua. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. See? What's agua? So smart these days. Agua. It's, it's water. I almost said agua is agua. Agua is agua. It's water, dog. <laughs> agua is agua. It's water, dog. Do you I not kn- know Spanish? No, I knew. I was just he, Of course he's testing us. How far... He w- has the IQ of Barack Obama, okay? He's going <laughs> to fuck with us. It's going to happen. Nice. I don't... Well, what is his? I th- I, doesn't he have a high IQ? This is my shitty pop I, culture knowledge. No. I read it on the internet on Reddit. Barack Obama's brother. That's the IQ that you have. Is his brother dumb or... <laughs> his bro- no, his, his brother's probably like an idiot. smart. There's no <laughs> his way. His brother's probably like an idiot. There's, uh, does he even have a brother? He does. Dude, he everyone does. has brothers. Yeah, I don't have a brother. But Barack Obama... Why the well, fuck? Why not? Why not? What'd you do? Fraternity brothers. Oh, oh fuck it. <laughs> see? <laughs> see, he walks out of his fucking frat room and he goes, yeah, I fucking did it. Uh. <laughs> he walks out and he goes, she totally wanted it. <laughs> Oh, and she's like, I did. No, and the out- she goes like this, I did. I'm actually moving in. <laughs> I go, no. No. I just had deja vu. Wow. Right of a girl right moving now? in? Just like I look looking oh. over it and going, oh. That's a trip. Yeah. Dude, you ever just think about like, what is this realm we're in? Do you ever get deja vu of your deja vu? <laughs> where you're like, yeah. I've thought about thinking about this before. Yeah. Well, now we're in the inception. Yeah. Now it's hey, weird. this conversation is brought to you by Pinner Products. Check out Pinner Products at all MedMed Med and Project Cannabis stores. At Pinner Products on Instagram. Check them out. Get that fucking woo woo. Yeah, we actually woo. need some more of that woo woo before we say that again. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my woo woo. Um, <laughs> yeah, do you, uh, wait. So okay, but you, uh, also tell everyone you, you used to be gay, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, didn't that everyone no, so tell like, them about the dicks? Tell them about the dicks. Explain how you went when you were like, "Oh, I'm not, I'm not gay." Well, like, but you were like, like that's because we, we, usually people go like, "Oh, you're raised to like date a girl or a guy," and they go that route first, and then they go, "Oh, I'm gay." You did it. Backwards, which is weird. Like, well, that's like, how you no, become I'm gay. If you do it backwards, <laughs> folks. Hey. It's not supposed to go there. <laughs> <laughs> you were like, you were hooking up with a lot of guys before you were like, oh wait, girls are an option too. You could just be mm-hmm. who you want, mm-hmm. and that's strange. My that's wife so is weird. gonna love this episode. <laughs> <laughs> babe, you were hooked up with a lot of guys. <laughs> yes, babe, I hooked up with a lot of bros. All factual. <laughs> That's how I learned that's about crazy. how to how to work with rifles. He yeah. yeah. <laughs> just comes out of a yeah. fucking room. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't go fishing a lot, but I did dock quite a bit. Do you understand <laughs> oh. my thrift, m'lady? Uh, Mike, do you know what docking is? Yeah, it's when you like, uh, mm-hmm. you know, like a, a boat pulls up to a fucking mm-hmm. marina. Yeah, and, and what's yeah. this? A boat. Describe see. these boats and this, these marinas. There's different types. I mean, there could be a 14 footer, a 16 Whoa. footer, an Hey-o. 18 footer. Wow. What? Yeah. <laughs> some of my memory reminds they, me. That's a, uh, some, a some, sometimes they're named. How these do people they name like, them? Such uh, as? And they can be dressed up pretty, too. Enrique and Eduardo. <laughs> Sometimes they're like speed racer. A 14 footer and a 16 footer. <laughs> but you hardly uh, know the difference at that size. <laughs> yeah. Or they're called like money ball. I'm surprised you know, they're still like conscious that. at that point. Yeah. They're crazy. <laughs> Not always. It's actually one yes, of the. Yes, you wanted it. One of the tricks to docking. Yeah, you wanted it. That's it's the, the, new rule. the yang. Someone's new, asleep. New rule is anytime anybody does this, you have to. Everybody has to do it. <laughs> I like doing this and saying no worries in text messages and emails. So I mean, you know. I do this in text messages now a lot more. Yeah, dude. dude when they made that an emoji, I was so happy. I was thrilled. Yeah. I went like this immediately with my real hand. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> then I typed it into no one. Um. No, docking mic is when two people they connect penises. So no, they make, make no, the no, snakes no, kiss. no, that's not no. Docking is <laughs> when a boat gets to a marina. <laughs> make the snakes you take it's those definitely snakes, not make them that. Kiss. Remember the GI Joe movie when Serpento would turn the snake into a solid snake and throw it like a spear? <laughs> so I just imagine like two snakes like and that. Then like some like dude swallowed it. And <laughs> <he's> like, <laughs> that's right. That's right. That venom is mm, <laughs> good. <laughs> Finger licking good venom. 
Oh. We had Thomas Dale on a couple weeks ago, and this is a gayer episode than that. Oh, dude. Like, <laughs> hey, it's also a better <laughs> one. Tell Thomas that. Oh, we fucking got him. He's not going to see this. No, but you should still I'll tell, him. Edit, should tell him. I'll that edit that 10 seconds and send it to him just to fucking make him mad. <laughs> I just want to. He'd be so angry. Can I, in a friendly, competitive way, tell him that I was gayer than him? <laughs> is that yeah. all right? Yeah, yeah. There's actually nothing more gayer than Thomas Dale. Nothing more gay? Mm. That's that's really nice English the way you said that. Because you said could have said there's nothing gayer, and you said nothing more gay. I like yeah. that. It's great. Because it's very intelligent. Right he has the intelligence right. of Barack Obama. Is that not the right that's way to do it? I've been telling you, man. Watch but I know. didn't even know. I just guessed. Is that the right? That's even way? smarter. He's guessing uh, the right stuff. Fuck, he's a natural Most genius. Having to guy. break these calculations down. No. Yep. Yeah, that's a time for it. <laughs> it's like something about shaking this. What do we got going on? I hate, I hate this zip zap zap we got going on here. <laughs> what do you hate? What do you got going on? Um. Oh, dude. I just. Ah, uh, fucking. I went on vacation with my parents. Oh, right? boner. <laughs> oh, okay. I got. <laughs> <laughs> We've been watching a lot of Pornhub. Is that what yeah. you do? B- b- boner. <laughs> hey, t- Mike's like taboo Sometimes family. I know anytime, where this goes. Anytime I get excited, I say boner. That's all right. You look like a fucking boner Jets coach or something. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I'm the new coach. <laughs> you know, you don't shave for a couple days and you wear a ball cap to your friends' podcast, and they roast you. But that's what you pay extra for. <laughs> cool. Um, so I went on vacation Sit up with my straight. parents. Not oh, like sorry, you're official. Sorry, yeah. Sorry. I do have bad posture, and I do need someone to constantly. I'm just kidding. I do need that. I need someone to be. Wait a minute, you feel bad about that? Suck in your gut. Have some pride. Make some eye contact. Hi. Hi. You want your balls out? You want with your parents? Jack off for the camera. Smile. Be confident. All right, bro. And I have never seen. You're talking about jacking off, dude. And well, this was the. So we went. We went to. We went to Palm Springs. Speaking of jacking off, we went to Palm Palm Springs. Springs. (laughs) <laughs> Which <laughs> is where you go to get jacked off in the desert when you have nothing better to do. It's true. Um, <laughs> it was hot, and the only thing there was a pool, and it was boring as fuck. It was great. That's we, the point. I had though. a great. I had a great time. I had a great. Let me amend that. I had a great time. But I saw. Did um, you? I saw. I had a fucking great time. Uh, I saw. I had a great. So time. So obviously somebody's watching this podcast <laughs> that is in his family. I um. I saw a man that had a flat butt. I'm a, I'm a, uh, uh, dude. I gotta say this. That irritates me. It, it irritates me, bro. It, Fix it, your genetics. Hang bro. on. Yes. It made you could have drawn a straight line from the base of his skull to his goddamn ankles. It was literally I know a few people like that, and I'm already pissed off thinking and down. about them. Yep. It's and yep. it made me. It was like how how do you wear pants? Fuck off. How do you eliminate wear pants? them? It, he literally his shorts would not stop falling down. I saw his butt crack. It looked like yes. a two by four that had a crack in it. Oh, fuck That's this all guy. it looked like. Fuck him. He and was you should old have as this fuck. opinion too. I am th- I appalled. Wait, whoa, whoa. Stand up. <laughs> yeah, stand yeah, up stand right up. now. Stand, stand up. up right now. Let's stand make sure. Oh, look at him. <gasps> no, he doesn't have- no, I don't. <laughs> he had- I don't know. Yeah. I don't- hold on, hold on. I no, did. I did that. It's, it's, it's not that flat. 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 Hold on. You were getting all quiet. So yeah, he, he was like, like oh, I got a flat I, ass. Well, I have a weak ass. So you, your, your ass is for sure weak. But all it's my not, physical therapists always tell me I have a weak ass. It's not. It's not my country. All my physical therapists tell me I got a weak ass. It almost looks like you graduated from flat ass. Like you had one in '97. In '97 to 2001, you had a flat ass. I have no glutes, so my knees and my my IT band, I always have injuries, and every physical therapist like, yo. Weak glutes. You have weak glutes. So you now know who else has weak glutes? Tell me. Fisherman. Jeez. On a boat all day. Jeez. Yep. That's why they have pillows that they sit on. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So go. This dude. I Pissed no, already. No. Fix it. That's what I'm saying. Fix it. Yeah. If you can, and get off the earth. Yeah. Get off it. the fucking earth. <laughs> Use <laughs> the planet. Where's it? Get you off. Can't, you shouldn't. You don't have to kill you yourself. jump. But you can't be on earth. You shouldn't be able to lay flat on the ground yeah. and have every point of your body be in contact Touches. with the ground. Yes, yes, that's true. <laughs> you should have an arch over the back. There should be Bro. there should be curves, there should be arches. I should be able to fit a hand underneath. Yes. This man was flat. Yeah, you're he listening needs, to the Master to Race go. podcast. <laughs> he needs to go. No, it's just it was great cuz you're You know sh- who has a flat ass? Mark Hayes. No, no, no. Here's here's the bad Irish part. Mark. Here was the bad part. Flat back, just giant stomach. Oh, it's a- So it was completely so, disproportional. Oh my god, that means he's always leaning. Yeah, he because was, how do you not fall over? It was just constant, like it was like really th- strong calves. I don't know. No, you have to to keep stay stay he up. He had tiny legs. He had very tiny legs. This guy's got to go. Show uh, us a picture. 
You know what? We're I just got a lot of nudes in this. <laughs> I'll, you know what? We're, fucking, we're going to edit that part of the clip and we're going to put up a picture of Marquez. He has a flat. He has no butt. Just I've made no, fun of him. No Mark, at all. fix it. Yeah. Mark, or, fucking fix it. Do or get cup, off earth. Do squats or something. Do get anything. off earth. Lunges. Deadlifts. Do walking lunges. You, Deadlifts. You Deadlifts are good. Stupid person. Glute bridges. Do you're f- less of a person. Literally, you're less of a person. Yeah, because you, you have less body. You don't have a butt. Body. You don't have a butt. You guys are making me do it right now just out of fear. Do you want to know why girls love guys? When they watch them go to the bathroom after after sex, they get to stare at the butt. Oh, they finally, that's the But when they see they a flat to... ass, they go, oh, I'm, the, I'm not calling him back. Ever again. Ever again. He's a one-night stand. Yeah. You were a one-night stand for a while, and you didn't even know that. And then, and, and then she must have you gotta... fallen in love with the front of you. You must have always <laughs> that's back. Why. You probably walked backwards to the bathroom. You're like, hey, babe. I I'll be right you. back. Don't miss me. <laughs> yep. And you would do the guns, and she was like, oh, I love him. That and was never great. saw <laughs> that. <laughs> So she keep doing the guns. She saw me going back. I did the I did a moonwalk with my boner. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. was trying to stay hard after sex um, just to show everyone how much fun I had. And I moonwalked backwards with my erection and kind of like to the side so it's like this and you never really <laughs> And then you got behind the door and you just And then I proposed to her while the bathroom door was closed. And I was like, good. See, yeah, and sealed. But then you got a butt and then you got married. That's right. Yeah. Then you get a butt. First you get the butt. <laughs> then you get the girl. First you get the <laughs> I feel I feel like we hurt your feelings a little bit, so <laughs> I'm sorry. It's very hard to hurt my feelings. Really? Yeah. I mean, you could do it. Don't get me wrong. I think you guys know me well enough now to. to I'm totally sorry. Well, I felt like I did for a second, and then I felt like I wanted to pull back. I felt like we went at you. And yeah, I we, saw I you. You kind of looked at me like, "Hey, I'm not really a fisherman," and I was like, "Oh shit!" Then. I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm so weak-willed uh, that I was like, "Am I a fisherman?" And I don't know it. <laughs> do they see who I am? Finally, Is this me. Some um, purpose. Thank you, God. You finally answered. I'm a fisherman. I'm not a dad. I'm a fisherman. And then I just leave and I never come back. My wife's like, what's my husband? And then you fucking run out with opening up the garage, but there's like one of those running. <laughs> just the fucking yeah. Like just like Looney Tunes? Yeah, like a Looney Tunes <laughs> fucking wall. Like, wow, he really fucking ran out of there. <laughs> with a fishing rod. like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's a fishing rod. Man, if um, do you guys ever fish? Now that yeah, dude, I used to fucking rip. I, I used to fished. rip lips. What you? Would you <laughs> over a decade at I least? I used to fucking. <laughs> I used to fucking just rip lips. What were you fishing? Fresh, uh, fresh lake, water. Where? <laughs> yeah, where are you fishing? Lake trout back in Pennsylvania. Oh, trout. Uh, we would go out in the middle of the night. Right, it was, it was the dopest shit. You got in the middle. There's of the nothing night. dope about fishing. So no, let's no, remove that. Hang word. on, hang on. There's nothing super dope. Fun. Super fun. It could be fun, but nothing dope. You would go out to the bar at like midnight, yeah. right? Uh, that's when you find fucking go to the bar, get that's lit. Cool. Here we go. You get lit. That's, that's cool. right. You get lit, and then you didn't do it. And then <laughs> oh, sorry about that. There there and then and then you would drive to the <laughs> lake, right? You have the boat on the bag already. Oh, this is very old, Greg. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> you drive to the lake. Yeah. What's, what's old, Greg? Old Greg, it's a it's a sketch from Mighty Boosh where they're that's like fishing at late at night on the lake. Yeah. <laughs> so he's and then you would just and then you would just be up all night until morning, <laughs> drunk as fuck on a boat. With trout, like waiting for trout. Yep. And you, you would, would give catch them. Yeah, you would have snacks and then you would get cheese and you would uh, you put it oh, down yeah. there. And then every once in a while, like halfway through, if you got like a bite, oh, you yeah. would like see it, it would go and everyone would be like, oh. get all excited. And then it would just go, oh, dude, the whap. T- and you'd be like, wham. And you got to like fucking, and you literally you do. Oh, the tug. And then you just, yeah, like yeah. it's literally you like eat this. the fish. Yeah, you. I mean, if it was big enough, you'd take it home. Yeah, it's already it. got cheese in it. And or everything. would you just put it back in the lake when you were Yeah, because I mean, you're just only hooking its lips, so you just put it back in the lake. It's a sport. You don't gotta kill See, everyone. When we fish in Florida, we would catch late for something. We'd catch the fish. Dude, it was so much fun. Beat it with a hammer. Oh, Jesus, you <laughs> psychopath, dude. dude. No, I'm that's kidding. you. Dude. No, you're not. You wanna, no, he's not. No, you, you want to look at the reaction he got? He was like, I'm, "I'm gonna say this, and then it's gonna be real." No, just, but you want to know the craziest thing? I swear to God, I didn't. The first time I caught a halibut, I was with my with my buddy's dad, and we were on a boat, and you have to knock it with a club because if you don't, they're giant fish. They will flop around. They could knock someone over and do all this damage so they're like all right now club it and i thought my, my friend's dad was like a super prankster like alpha male dude he's like all right johnny you gotta club it and i was like yeah yeah very funny Camille. and then he was like no you gotta club it and i had to, it was like a lord of the flies thing That's like hilarious. all my friends are all standing around club i was the only it, one that caught a fish that day too and they were just watching no everyone was like sweating and being like is john gonna do it like the paul thomas anderson music <laughs> this should like, be doof, animated doof. and i like i had to like i was like i literally like walked away from like my buddy Camille and i like joked about it for years like i i have killed like like <laughs> you, like oh, you go, you wow. walk away. Like someone that worked at the slaughterhouse. Like I had to fucking hit a fish with a fucking. You like you have a club. That's it's, a funny it's fucking nuts. story. Yeah, is dude. it funny or terrifying? It's, it's, it's a funny. Little terrifying. I would like to see it animated. Did you ever go? Did you ever go? <laughs> That's hunting? how funny it is. That he's would like, be good. He's like, no, you gotta do it. He was. He, he was so funny a like that. Cigarette. He fucking hands you the bat and you're like. He had a handlebar mustache. You have Oh, even better. Sweat coming out. Yeah, you're just like. He was the funniest dude. Like a shadow over top of you. Um, did you ever go hunting? 
hunting? No, I was actually he he passed, but he was the guy that I was like, if I ever if someone's ever gonna pop my hunting cherry, I'll I've do go, it. I've gone hunting. Like a Have you ever gone hunting? Thing for me, I, I don't I've know. Never gone hunting. Fucking intense. Gnarly. I don't know if I could yeah, do it. That's all I've ever heard from like I don't from know if I sensitive do it. dudes. I've heard it's like an intense. It's like it's a situation. fucking. It's a. Fu- and you, wait, you've killed so, an can animal. You, can you please tell us the story? I've I've. It is funny, right? Did you guys out? I've killed an animal. Yeah, I've killed a deer. Welcome back to Guns Night Out. I've I've killed two deer legally. Are you kidding me? No. Get out of here. Get out of here. Why? No, it's a figure of speech. I, I, really ate, I ate People them say, afterwards. Yeah. People say, delicious. get out of here. You ate deer. Yeah. I Venison, think that's even don't. worse. I think just kill them Why? and then move on and be no, a bad guy. No, that's crazy. No, that's horrible. Eating them. That's horrible. It's better to eat them. Well, Because now I'm using how them. How would you like if that deer heard, oh, you got shot. Oh, really? Oh, I died. No, and then they ate you afterwards. <laughs> what? Like, think about <laughs> his point of view. You'd, you'd be stoked if your buddy got if your buddy got. Bro, eaten if I got after murdered got, by a serial killer and then he ate me after, I'd be like, oh, that's horrific. Yeah, it's horrific, but like, I'm also not. I'm Just kill me. I'm at the top of the on to go what on the, to the next person. No, I've never thought about that way before. You're that's just thinking really about it like point. that. No, I don't know though, but I'm I'm using it. I'm <laughs> using really it for like everyone's thinking about yeah. like, it's better to like be if a you, serial. If you killer. get murdered, you want it to be by a cannibal, right? Like yeah. at least they ate me and they no, use my bones don't. for glue, right? Yeah. Like all right, what like, happens? That's the worst way. Uh, so I also, have, deer's not a thing on menus. So why are you eating? That's it? why you have to hunt it. It's good. Yeah, that's why you're gonna fucking you want to do. You, 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 you can go to you can go to me, you can go to restaurants and get venison. You can go to fucking animals down here. Venison? Yeah, sounds like something that poisons you. Venison? Yeah, you get down yeah, to the beach. real men try and then fucking eat it. And now we're, I'm immortal to all poisons. You killed Bambi's mom. We don't know the, bro, whose mom it was. killed Bambi's dad. <laughs> oh, free. <Jesus. laughs> and then her, ate her. it. Yeah, and I ate him. Uh, and then, yeah. yeah I, no, just I, under, I, I understand that people hunt and I understand it's a thing. And The like, hunting for I, I, sport it's not for is me. bad. Like, yeah, it's not for me, but listen, that's the world we live in, and that's like pe- what's when the people okay. get so mad about that. I'm like, yo, there's people getting slaughtered in it's, other it's countries. It's nicer than like, slaughterhouse stuff. But like, yeah, yeah. but like, think about it. Like, think about it. Like, if if we if you just like you all, you do the same thing to chicken and beef. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You kill and you eat yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So it's like, what's the difference? Also, between fucking deer? lions kill them. Like, dude, they, they dude, run, exactly. Everything hum, hum, I was just thinking that hunts. if you look at the animal kingdom, humans are yeah. actually the nicest hunters. The yeah, way we yeah, kill, yeah, we're yeah. like, we shoot them, we go, Pow. doom, doom, you're dead, or you die quickly afterwards. Yeah, yeah. lions watch make a you look. They're like, look at your friends run free. Yeah, and then they go, dude, you they, watch like a chimpanzee. Eat alive. Have you watched a chimpanzee eat a baby deer like on like yeah, a Discovery Channel show? They eat it while the deer is just going, and the deer doesn't even know what's going on, and they're ripping it apart, eating it, and slowly, and they're, I'm like, snap the deer's neck. They don't even have the decency. We're the nicest hunters. There's the, there's the, there's like a thing on like Planet Earth. Or some shit. We're like, this became a sad, it's a pa- terrifying sad episode. episode. The saddest episode, huh? <laughs> so you're a dad? It gives me purpose. You like hunting? <laughs> we have to hunt, folks. Well, that's it. Check out Fantasy House. It's real good times. See you later, folks. Like, gee, Louis. <laughs> Let's talk about something Jesus. funny and light. Uh, you guys like pork rinds? I love them. They pop in your mouth. Hunt them. <laughs> I'm pork rinds. Oh, bad, bad hunt example. <laughs> you guys ever hunt people? Oh, shit. Um, you ever watch that movie where Ice Cube is running from a, was it Ice Tea? One of the drinks. No. The drinks rappers. <laughs> the drinks is going after the ice cube. One of the drinks rappers. Hey, we're going to edit this part out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How funny is it to say that? They're going to straight the hey. We're going to probably edit that last five <laughs> minutes. Out. Take it, out. it is hilarious. That's, uh, that, that's that deadpan, straight laced uh, Linochi humor that I love so much. I saw something that was a brazen. A brazen. Um, <laughs> A brazen saw, abuse saw, of the a rules, raisin. A, bra- a brazen abuse of the I rules, love raisins. which I love. I'm a, I'm a huge fan of just like the fuck you mentality, seeing in other people. What do you mean? Uh, Piss off. Yeah, like the kind of like, nah, I don't care about the rules kind of shit. Oh yeah. Oh, that's uh, me. That's or, healthy. Or even like, that's me. even like, v- like loosely enforced rules. That's so. Me. What do you? Do? What is that voice? That's me. <laughs> get your feet off of both of the tape. Choose one or the other. I think I, I get to use. You both. don't get to use both. Get one or the other. It's that's for the job. guest. That's for you. What's? Well, it's up to you, bro. Do I get to use both? Choose. Or Choose where I his feet go. I sit up straight like a goddamn good host. <laughs> wow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you had, I'm sorry you had right. Sometimes you get invited for dinner. Yeah, Listen, you, you we're not gonna fight. get divorced. We still love you. I Sometimes just, we fight. Um, I used to have that shirt. This shirt, exactly. I bought it. He at a says that like he got rid of it. He was like, he's like, I used to have that shirt. <laughs> that was, it's that's so what fucking I was leading. condescending. I was going to a next it's bit. So he, condescending. He called it out. for like ten it's years. So yeah. It's so I, like, I got rid of it because I was like, that shirt I'm sucks. Than this shirt. <laughs> <laughs> and then I walked. You know why? Because I was like, shit. I've graduated from fishing. And then <laughs> I've moved on. <laughs> First rule of fishing club: If you think you graduated, you still need more fucking fishing. <laughs> you fucking dick. You're a funny character. What were you saying about raisins? Um, no. Anyways, I saw I saw a woman uh, 
<laughs> I, it didn't Brings work it. the first time, and it got it the second time. And I was like, I'll, as I'm, a callback, as yes, like, I'm here as a callback. I it. I you had it in your pocket, and you were like, I'm getting this across. Yeah, I saw a woman break the 15 uh, item or less rule at the express checkout. Well, yeah. by a lot. Like she rolled up with like a cart full of stuff, and the woman was like, the cashier was like, "This is 15 or less." And then she had the audacity to be like, "One, two, three. Oh, and she no was, way. She got to like 12 and was like. <laughs> we need better preschools, dude. We need it better was, preschools. It was so fucking tense. Like I've never had more of a tense like checkout experience. I was behind. I've I was right behind happen. her, and th- this woman scanned literally like twenty five items. She was like, but the whole time she was just like, boop, and just like tossing it down to the end. Oh, why the girl? The girl wouldn't go away. Wouldn't go away. So the woman, like, the woman put like a cart full of shit down, and then the the cashier was like, hey, fifteen items or less. We have a rule. And then she was like, she she went. Uh, Two, three, four, uh, and then just didn't move. And then she didn't even finish she didn't counting. Even fucking she was like trying to show it like, It's not that. She was like, was it sixteen two, or seventeen though? Twenty-five, because it has the counter at the bottom. I'm sitting there watching. I'm going. I'm counting the beeps. She's going boop, boop, and and like the cashier is throwing her oh, stuff. Yeah. To the end of the thing. No, this is fucking Ralph. Oh, Ralph. She's just Ralph's throwing her corporate. shit to the end of the end like, of the thing. Corporate and, and then big, big um, corporate. I mean, and then uh, the, I guess it's corporate, corporate plug. Corporate too. <laughs> it's corporate plug. It's, Co- everything's this is brought to you by Ralph's corporate. Plug. If you're thinking about grocery as well, watch this. <laughs> and then the bagging experience was just the cashier. She's jamming all this <laughs> Yeah, they're already and pissed. And into like three bags. She was like, boom. Oh. And just like threw in her And what did the lady box. do? She, she was like, like, I have cats. She was like, she, for sure, you have cats if you're fucking sitting there doing 20. Paid in a $100 bill. Oh, old. Old as fuck. No. Russian. No. Russian. Stupid. Is pay, wait, is just paying in a $100? Shitty whore. Just, just an asshole. What's the problem with paying with $100? Bill? It was like a there $30 isn't. order. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay. So okay. she was like 73. Well, she's getting changed. 70. She's getting changed. Oh, she's got, did she, did she have was, a flat butt too? Did I mean, she, you guys are real fashion. Oh, like, did she know. have fucking a Manny and Petty done yet? No. 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 She didn't. Manny. I don't know. I didn't look at her toes. All, I didn't Manny, look at her toes. I'm going to be honest with you. Manny and Petty wouldn't shop for more than 10 items at a uh, grocery store. Really? How can you say that? Because they eat out a lot for free because they're what? bitches. Wait. All women that get Manny and Petties? Very perceptive. Yeah. All women that get Manny and Petties eat out for free at most restaurants. <laughs> Is like an eighty twenty rule, or is hundred percent pay with a hundred dollars? Do they go? Do they go in there? Do they go? Uh, that'll be seventeen fifty. She goes. I just went to the salon today. <laughs> oh, yeah, two things. I Can just... someone go in my purse to get my money out for me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And someone's just like, right, you know what? It's fine. You can it go was ahead. a stupid premise, but I think it could be a thing. Uh, two I things. Think, I here's remember. what I here's what I think. I think you got a little bit of a head full from him telling you that you take everyday <laughs> observations a little bit too well earlier. Oh no no and I, then you no, went, no no no. I got one really good. <laughs> no, I was just being a dick, and then no, that's not what it is. This ends with you guys getting that. mad at me. You're like you, you really you gas- fucking ruined our gas pocket. lit his yes. pride. You gaslit his fucking pride, and you ruined everything. Yeah, next time, fucking iron your clothes before you come. Jesus, oh, did you dude, just wake kidding. up in a van? Yeah. Did oh, you, shit. Did you, you just get van? done at your shift at the fucking local consignment did you leave the shop? Car on while your kids are waiting in the car. <laughs> did you put the windows down? Uh, <laughs> I, oh, we live in an airstream on Sunset. It's right outside. What? <laughs> I just got done on my shift at the pawn shop. I gotta go record a podcast. Daddy will be back later on. You kids leave the gate down. Yeah, you fucking do work at a pawn shop. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> God, <laughs> chefs. I can blame for working. <laughs> you fucking dick. <laughs> By the way, people fucking think I work at a pawn shop. At oh. the pawn shop. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> I don't know. At the pawn shop. Hey, Mike, do you have anything else to talk about? Yeah, cocks and stuff. <laughs> cocks and stuff. Cocks and dicks and shit. Cocks um, and stuff. I think I... Uh, You're running with a microwave or video games or patients or some shit you said to me? Yeah. Some texts? The video game thing I got important? off. We're also, no, oh, yeah. We're also like 45. Yeah, I know, but, but uh, there's a... Uh, I do... Do you guys mi- do you microwave your food sometimes? I like, don't have a microwave right now, but when I'm at a oh, house, whoa, 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 you don't have I a don't microwave? Have Why? I never Why? have. I, 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 Why? How do, what, what if how something's do reheat? cold? Yeah, how, how do you reheat, reheat it? things? The I have, oven? I have a dope the like room? mini oven and a regular oven. So if it's pizza, it goes in the mini oven or buffalo wings mini oven. If it buffalo needs, wings, you eat a lot of buffalo wings? I love <laughs> buffalo wings. Are you reheating buffalo wings? Oh, yeah. I mean, who's not finishing all of the buffalo wings? Sometimes you order. I'm going to take these home. Pizza, I understand. you order extra. Sometimes you order extra so that you do have some leftover buffalo wings. Who's fucking not finishing the buffalo wings? All right. 
Stop judging for how many buffalo wings get eaten. Maybe in that's session. why your ass is flat and you fucking fish too much. <laughs> the, your ass is flat and you fucking fish too much. Get out! You call yourself an American? You gotta you go. Great, you have great artwork though with your fucking thing that you just clicked <laughs> on a computer. So in, it's so intense. It's very busy. You're so aggressive about it. Yeah, you gave it, it, to it us. is busy. But I guess I, I thought it'd be fun to be busy like that. John yeah, gave me a uh, fantasy house sticker. I got stickers made. And he's like, Yeah, I know fantasy Mike really house. well. What do you think I want to fucking put this with? I'm the back of my computer yeah i figured you would do something like what you said you were gonna do put it on the back of a, someone's bumper yeah yeah it's perfect i think that's that that's that's, that's the, how that's i felt the like move. <laughs> and then it you will get, be used properly you get hit up on fucking instagram youtube you get a fucking message like excuse me somebody vandalized my <laughs> car with your your i'm fantasy le- house what is this sex ring you got going are my kids going here it's like a lady with kids you're violating the lease agreement on my, my kids Toyota do drugs Camry? at your house are they doing drugs and having sex out of fantasy that sounds like a porn thing the orgy the house? cops come you get arrested they're like they take your kids away they're like what are you doing you got porn problems House. Just for like, it's a podcast. It's kind of like MTV Cribs meets freaking Morty. <laughs> like while I'm in court, <laughs> <laughs> I like I like. Will you subscribe? I look at the judge like, would you just subscribe to see? Maybe you'll even like it. Dude. Yeah. Give me a review. Judge. He's like, after reviewing a few episodes, I heard one with Michael and Ochi. You're going to jail, oh, dude. I'm like handcuffed and like and Chris is there. Like, see what you fucking did, with Ochi? <laughs> You're like I just want to. I just want to say this for the court. Uh, it, uh, you can find it on iTunes. Uh, <laughs> she says everything. <laughs> Your children will be taken away from you because of this podcast. Or on iTunes, you can follow us on Twitter at Fantasy House Podcast. <laughs> um, yeah. So give it. Uh, give us the plug one more time. Fantasy House. Wait, did you tell us like the true hunting story? You just kind of said you went hunting and then. I, you went, ate, I mean, it wasn't. It, like, I, I want. I want like a like here's, here's Leonardo the, DiCaprio looking through the scope. I sat in the woods for he, three why, hours. He has a scope. He looks through. I sat in the woods that, for three. Yeah, I killed he, one with a gun and I killed one with a bow and arrow. I sat. Oh, in the a woods. bow and arrow. Whoa, yeah, you're bro. sick, fucking guy. Really, bro, Rogan. That's kind of cool. How did you do it? You pulled it back and let go. Yeah. And anyone can do this. Seventy pounds. Seventy pounds. Per square you have the little click Wait, thing. Wait, it's, it's heavy? You like the little yeah. click thing? The little trigger? Yeah, had a little release. Oh, fuck, wow. I brought that baby back. Did you, hey, now. did you gain weight? Did I gain weight? Yeah. Since the last recording? No. no. Are you sure it's been a couple of weeks? I don't know. Maybe he did. <laughs> did you gain weight? I didn't did you drink weight. a lot of beer? No, I didn't drink yeah, a lot good of beer. You got that thick ass. Yeah, now. you look like you got a thick ass. Yeah, I, thick- I mean, I'm fucking sw- I'm sw- sw- swolerific. It may be, maybe it's the, <laughs> uh, the swole. It's the pattern. It might be the pattern. Yeah. If you look fat. It sucks that you fucking, because of social media, anything you wear, like people, anytime I wear this, people are like, do you have a, do, don't you have any other hoodies? I'm like, <laughs> yeah. But like, Fuck off! Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't just like, <laughs> like <laughs> this is my hoodie for this yeah, next like, six months. Yeah, a slave this made this. Hoodie. You want me just also, to throw it I away? I have different hoodies, wearing. but you notice this one because of the color. But like, and I posted with it three times because I wear it a lot. In but a it row. doesn't mean I'm not. I'm wearing it every day in a row. You. F- but Mike, that's their way of just they're connecting you to you. They're, they're, I don't want to connect with up. people. Yes, you do. You're a comic. Yeah, they, yeah that's you all do. you want. Yeah, when all I'm on stage, off stage, life is a stage. Michael Anochi, look around. This is the audience members, eh? To be or not to be. Um, <laughs> My yeah, I just, I just killed, a, I just killed, with I killed a bow and arrow. That, that seems like a slow death. No, I mean, doesn't that just go through their heart and make them go? I don't, if you hit their heart, he's not he a goes, fucking, he's not Robin Hood. Yeah, where'd you shoot him? The who? Probably got him in the butt, yeah. and he's like, and then he had to walk up and nope. shoot him with a gun. No, oh. I put it through his heart. You did? Yeah, right behind the front shoulder. I mean, your blood pressure is gonna go skyrocket. Well, uh, well, you've only done this once in your life, and you hit the heart the first try. Yeah, because I practiced. Just shooting at a target a bunch of other times. Yeah, so did the fucking DC shooter in Seattle. <laughs> Where is your geography at? Pull your mask off, Scooby Doo villain. <laughs> the DC yeah. serial killer shooter was practicing in Seattle. Was it? No. Yes, you, in the back no, of a that. Kurt Cobain no. was practicing in Seattle. Guitar it's a po- on his face. In Washington, they were doing practice. They were practicing. Kurt shooting. Cobain went Drove to shooting to range once and then never went again. <laughs> That's actually yeah, really. Wait, he did it at a Nirvana shooting range. Yeah, he killed Thought himself. he did it in his room. No, I'm just saying he went to the, he oh. went to his own shooting range. Um, <laughs> but so uh, still the bone arrow hit him. Hit him and then you went up and do you like snap it off and then no. put it in your mouth? It fucking cleared. It went right through him. Wow. The bone arrow goes through the gnarly! animal. Yeah, dude. That's so gnarly. Because I'm pulling. Yeah, because otherwise so many pounds I'm pulling of so many pounds of pressure. Like little hole that it they goes. Really go that hard? Yeah, dude. Because it's like because you have the you have it's the broad insane. head on it. And it's literally fast? like a dart. So like imagine a imagine a imagine like a razor blade on the. Sh- like sharpened oh, into a wow. point yeah. on the end of your arrow so it goes swoop and then the arrow's carbon fiber so it goes right through it it doesn't it's so thin that it passes through oh man this is making me feel bad 
It's, I mean, I mean, life's gnarly, Mike. Yeah, this, it really this, is. This like, realm is I'd ran by the devil. Fucking, this realm not, is ran I'd by the ignore devil. Ignore it. I mean, but like, well, you can't do that. No, too, but, but I, I mean, mean we right humans now. have hunted by bow and arrow for sure, literally millions since, of years since when uh, Car- Christopher Columbus ran for president. Yeah, yeah. 1492. Mm-hmm. That's when he yeah. ran for president. Yeah. He won. That's right. Uh, he was our first president. He was um, our first president. He was. A great yeah. one. And he, so was a, he was the first French president. He had too. the watermelon was, tree. He was, was thir- French. Th- it was 35 yards out. Told a and lot of lies. 35? Yeah. It's a fucking, I got to throw a football. For th- it's a 45. It's a fucking rush. Like, there's a difference. Did you feel guilt afterwards? Uh, I, f- I felt like. You definitely gained weight since a then. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I felt a little bad. Yeah, it shows in the neck. Initially, <laughs> I felt a little bad initially, and then um, <laughs> a lot of rocky road to get over. It. A lot of rocky road oh, to get over. It. Thick neck. I've been doing a lot of neck lifts. Um, you guys are like two of the fittest podcasters <laughs> around, so it's funny having you roast uh, each other for your looks. No, you no but it's, it's super intense. Of compliments. I know he's so fucking nice. You we gotta are, bring him back. Yeah, we gotta. Bring um, him back. You want dark Johnny? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but it's it's super intense because like you're like oh I I've seen a deer before yeah. right, yeah, but then there's a so difference cute. between like like a deer rat and a deer. No, like uh, there's a difference between like a deer when you're just like on the like hey there's a deer on the side of the road. He's cute. And a deer like when oh, you're in evil because the, no, they have no, fangs. No, no oh. when you're in the woods well, like hunting it, like, it's like it's completely different. Like your heart, like what I'm saying is like your adrenaline completely changes. Yeah. So it's like, it's literally like a shot of adrenaline once the deer shows up. So like, you're like, I practiced all the times in my backyard sure. shooting a fake deer and this sure, is exactly what, like what it's going to be like. And too. then you actually do it, you get out there and you're like, oh my God. Yeah. Oh my God. And you're fucking, you're like just jingling like, cause your heart's beating a thousand miles. Cause you're looking around. The minute you, you let go of that arrow, you're, you changed as a human. They're literally camouflaged. Yeah. So you're like, totally. Or you were always that human. They're literally camouflaged. You just always were that person. You haven't <laughs> done it yet. Also that oh, totally. I've heard dude. that before. Um, well, so t- like times like a big loaf of bread, right? So so like you'll be sitting in the tree stand or whatever, and then you'll oh, just oh you're in one of those things in the tree. Yeah. So like you'll be oh those things are fucking just bitch. standing in your you own gotta poop. You got to be in the wa- <laughs> you got to be in, in your the pants, wild doing it. Pooping in your pants, peeing everywhere, <laughs> and then <laughs> and how, how long do you have to wait for? I gotta just get a sh- I'm just you waited like seven hours to see. Waited like three. It came in like three hours. Yeah, you get out there like bro. I'm going out for forty five minutes. If I don't see anything, I'm like this is done. I thought you were saying three hours. Like you didn't even put in that much time. You're saying three hours is a ton of time. Yeah, dude. You go. Out, go you bowling. Go out like, you got at like six a.m. I think I killed it by like nine after like an early morning. Like they they travel in the morning. The fuck are you doing um, for three hours? Fucking waiting, that's dude. What that's you what do. hunting. Bro, is. you could have went to a DMV twice in that time. That's fine, but it, that's what Not it's called, called hunting. DMV. You literally just sit there. That's why it's boring. That's why I stopped doing it. I was like, I don't want to sit in the woods for. That's three why those hours. guys are fat. Yeah, because they eat fucking trail mix with candy in it. So, anyways, <laughs> so like you're like it's 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 so intense. Like so, like you're looking around the woods and you don't see any deer, and then you look this way, and then you come back this way, and there's a fucking deer standing right there, and the predator, and, and predator, predator is fucking <laughs> it. He's he's blurry, and you're like, is he standing in front of the deer? Is this deer pixelated? The three what is, dots what the is this deer in an Asian <laughs> porno? Because he's all pixelated and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. And then you're just like, what is? And then you shoot it, and Sometimes. then you fucking it goes through its heart, and then it runs away, and then you track it for however long it takes, and then you wait. How long does it stay up? <laughs> it runs. It runs wait, for after it gets hit in the heart. Yeah, after it gets so hit it in the heart, so it doesn't die right runs. away. It doesn't die right away, but it starts bleeding out everywhere, and then you got to wait. You wait like twenty minutes. What do you mean 20, 20 minutes? So like you shoot it. Yeah. It hits. The deer runs away. Well, start chasing it. No. Why? Because then it's going to run away. So It's you still are, running away. Hang on, dude. There's you're two not guys are running away, Lenochi. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Because then you don't want to pressure it into doing something. So what I'm saying is What's like- What's it going to do? Go, ah, oh, I can save myself. <laughs> he, he, or he pulls his own gun out. It's dying. Like, you, Reservoir <laughs> yeah, dog like, style. Man, what, you fucking- What, what is that going to It's like, you don't want- Like, it's like- it, I can't depending, go that No, far. depending on depending on where you shot it, right? Yeah. Because sometimes you might not get the heart, you might get the stomach, you might. But like, you want to like wait for it to fucking die. That's awful. Kill it faster. No, dude, that's not how it works. You literally can't. You should otherwise you get shoot a machine a gun. gun. Yeah, there, there's different seasons. You can't go out with a bow and a gun and be like, I don't feel. What I feel like fucking firepower today. It's like, oh why? Hey, in fall from like October to December no is. Yeah, like Why? There's, there's bow and arrow season, then there's rifles. What's, I don't know, dude. I'm not the fucking fielding well, game. We'll have happen. these answers ready next time. Why? I wasn't story. expecting to field answers well, about the fucking well, woods. We want to know. That's what happens. We find out a fucking story. We want to know more things about because, it. Because it's, it's way less. That's it's why we had easier. you on our podcast, right? I, That's why we had you on our podcast. This is your guy's podcast. This is my podcast and your podcast. Oh, I get confused sometimes because this guy fucking. What if I pull that boat out? You guys are both just regular guys. Everyone shuts up like I shot a gun off. Yeah, I don't know why they do different seasons, but it's all in the same. 
right, because you can't be you can't be walking around with a gun and people are walking around with bows and arrows and like. Well, but they wouldn't. They yeah. wouldn't if that was the so like rule. Bo- so like bow season lasts from September yeah. t- or like October first. You're a bad guy. What? You're a bad guy. Why? That's what Why am I a bad guy? You've kill- you killed an innocent and animal. And then I ate it afterwards that's like the fucking s- circle that's even of the st- life. That's even more of a psychopath. Elton John Imagine- sang a song about Imagine it, dude. Killing someone and then eating them. They made a Disney movie about it. Yeah, Bambi. It's actually nicer that you actually took the like that, you, that he went and, and killed something that he ate because yeah, like, then I used it. I used it. I know that. I know that. I know that. I know that. Okay. I know that. That's the census in in in, in yeah. our, our, But I'm making the observation and the joke that it's actually crazy. No, it's to not. Eat something you just killed. Why? Because I'm using it for as food. A human. I'm using it for food. Well, you don't need that. Yeah, you can go to Chick Fil A. It's open. Then I'm killing a bunch of fucking chickens. In they're the same already manner. dead. You didn't kill them. They don't. Somebody else did. They're not cooked them. They're not born dead. No, but that wasn't you didn't have to think about it or do it and also maybe- hey mike hey mike we're not born dead dude yeah we're Blow dead before mic we're drop <laughs> that's a great mic stand for mic drops nothing happens no one gets hurt um yeah it's better to eat it no because then you're just leaving like a fucking like well, dude, a body I, I, count out in the woods when, this I, was, when, I, brought when, you when by I was, when I was a little kid and i used to kill ants i would fucking scoop them all up and then you hit a, you fit a hit you hit a fish how thing. many ants did you have you oh because no when i killed like a whole farm if there was an ant pile oh, outside yeah. my, i would fucking scoop them up genocidal and maniac. Them on my salad because i was like i can't just kill them and this not fucking eat them. maniac yeah well that's how i learned i was like ants if taste killed, gross too have you ever eaten i killed yeah but not with balsamic i killed two deer i was just testing you dog i killed two deer you you killed hundreds of ants. You yeah, but I ate them. them. Psycho, so I ate them. I ate them too. I ate them all. I made jerky out of them and steaks and chili. Do you have any left? No, I don't. I got a really any. sad story right here about. And I went to my neck. One time, my buddy asked to to watch his iguana. Right, and he came over and killed it and ate no, it. No, my, do- my, my dog. I my dog. My dog on that thing. I was like, yeah. <laughs> no, but my dog broke <laughs> the nightmares. cage. My dog broke the cage and killed it. Okay, dog. He, right? like, he was away for the summer. I was like, hey, my dog. Cut his neck. It was like his neck was just That's cut. That's hilarious, dude. It was, a, it was so bad. It was like what happened? What did he do? I guess like did he, he, the, he, just he like, pushed cool the cage down and went in and grabbed it. He was a Jack Russell Terrier and went and killed it and then left terrier it there. Killed him. It was oh, fucked dude. up. So and I, no, I told my friend I was like, okay, you know, and then like Can I get you another one. You won't know. I don't think he was that. Did you ever see a snake eat a rat? Yeah, all the time. It's so, I, it's so they think that's why? inhumane because mice, mice and rat are smarter than snakes. So yeah. it's kind of inhumane to like just capture them and make them eat the. That's a fucked. Hey, anyone hey, who has a snake, I'm hey, like, I don't want to be Mike, friends with you. He's got a good point. You have a this snake. This guy's got a good point. He's got a good point about the snake thing. I didn't even come At up with it. At least I'm a higher intelligence than a deer. That's right. You got to eat know, the deer. How do you know that the the mouse is smarter than the snake? Because mice are. Well, I mice don't personally, can, but like neuroscience. Yeah, and all science. Who said they this? You, you learn that or you read it? Dude, right. that's why we test on mice and not snakes. No, because they have the closest uh, organs to yeah. us. Yeah, and the brain. Their brain. Their brain. They got dope little brains, dude. They got dope little brains. They, they can, can solve problems. problems. They can solve with problems. tails and big ears. Why are you holding that like you just left class? Yeah, my hands are hurting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'll All find right. a different way. When things ache, you just find different ways to do stuff until that aches. How so, are you older than me? That's how I You're less than me, right? That's my motto when I fuck. I'm 30 You're less than me. No, I'm older than you guys. I'm 38. You're more than me. I'm an adult, man. I'm 38 years old. He's a dad. I'm like that gun, a 38. You look you look. Actually, they don't cock. You don't cock at that. Thank you. You look like you played baseball for three years when you were younger, and everyone was like, oh, he was actually had a lot of potential, but he just wasn't into it. He just got into fishing. He smoked a lot of dope and started fishing, and then. You look like you pitched old timey style, too. Like, you like you like go behind the back. Oh, like you come back up you and kick so the leg out. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You also <laughs> fucking sometimes your sh- yeah, like jersey <laughs> was untucked, and I was like, "Bro, look better." <laughs> or, like, it yeah, or it was like super baggy. You know what I mean? Baggy. Like the high socks. Oh, yeah. yeah. And then he had like a weird. He had like a one weird pitch. He's like, "This is called the super spitball." And you're like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, yeah. And he talked different too. I had an opium yeah. habit and like a weird one of those girlfriends with the weird lipstick in the 1920s. Yeah, dude. his and hands. That's are, before he was his straight. His hands are covered in before, before I was straight. Oh, I was straight. a gay baseball player. I hit a few balls, if you know what I mean. I wasn't a stranger to a bat. First. Uh, hey, go to <laughs> check out <laughs> sliding into first. Okay, slide into home. <laughs> oh, I like it. It's fine. <laughs> uh, check out Fantasy House on <laughs> iTunes. Um, what's the Instagram? Uh, Fantasy House Podcast. Yeah. Um, uh, I'll, do you I'll, have a website? I'll, yeah, enough about him. It's we got our Patreon. Yeah. We got our $1 Patreon, too. $5. Yeah, we got a $1 Patreon, $5 Patreon, $10 $1 Patreon. $1, just even a dollar helps. Think of us as like a sick Somalian child. $1 fucking helps. <laughs> Every dollar helps. <laughs> Every dollar uh, helps to feed Mike's little tiny reviews. belly. Look at his little distended yeah. belly. It's so... 
you keep it, uh, it keep needs leaving it. those reviews and subscribe and uh, on iTunes, so check, on check Spotify. Out, check out John, right? Yeah, check out John's. Uh, <laughs> what's it? for like ten years? Podcast. It's called <laughs> uh, uh, Fantasy House. Swimming in a house. Fantasy and, House. Fantasy house. And it's Thanks cool, for- and and we'll release our episodes that we did of his later this week. Yeah. and you know, uh, so you're gonna get those on Friday. Yeah, I'm so stoked. Re- yeah, we're gonna D- release- double both of them will on Friday. Yeah, we're yeah, gonna yeah, we're gonna release both of our episodes, Mike's and mine, on uh, Fantasy House on Friday. Um, so you can check those out. If Fun you times. yeah, if you screenshot it and or, or subscribe or, and then uh, put it on our story, we'll repost it on the story to see whose episode you were listening to. Because I think I think there's I think there's a couple of people that have actually been on this podcast that have been on Fantasy House. Oh, uh, for sure. Nicole Amy has yeah. been on. Oh yeah. Have you had Craig on? Craig Conan? Not yet. No, no. yet. No, no, no. I'd love to. Though. Thomas. Thomas Gay Dale. Dale would be. Oh, dude, Dale would be great. Uh, we'll yeah. get the one. Yeah, so there's, there, there's a. So you'll see us. You'll see our episodes, and then yeah. uh, on Friday, and then. And those uh, episodes are fire, dog. Mm. They are fire. It's gonna be good. I'm still. Uh, Guysonoutpod.com. Uh, submit your stories. Submit your questions. Submit your topics there. Uh, check us out on YouTube, Spotify. Uh, leave a review on iTunes. Oh, isn't I, is I, iTunes going away? Leave us a review on Apple Podcasts. That's what it's called. Let's, now. It's the same thing, right? No, no, there's, I no, let's, let, yeah. That's Leave a review on Apple Podcasts. Apple Podcasts is the new thing. Yeah, thank you to our sponsor, App Pinner Products on Instagram. Check them out. John, what's um, your address? We, we do that at the end. Tell everyone Yeah, you can tell them your home address. Yeah, your home My address. home address is. Yeah, it's just a fun thing we do. Like or your uh, phone number. 147. Social security number also works. Uh, used to Fisherman Street. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, Mike, say goodbye. Thanks goodbye, so much. Bye, guys. Hey, excuse me.